so dear students while learning html today we will learn how to make a simple web page so first of all as i am telling you in school also you have to make one folder so you have to right click new folder this you all know i may i am giving the name as what we are giving in school student double click it and here i can give uh, again uh, not in your at home no problem but otherwise in school i used to tell you that you have to make according to your class 9th a 9th b okay so here you are free to do so here i'll save my work here only but i'll make the folder because i may use for different classes so in your case i am making 9th because i am taking both collectively 9th and 9th b so after this very simple software we have to use for our html coding so that is notepad what we have to use notepad okay notepad we have to use so i'll open notepad so this is my notepad so i'll write the coding for you just to make the simple program in html i know you are dying to start directly the practical part so i am just going with that only so first of all always the first command i'll just increase the size so that you can easily see it easily what i am typing and you know uh, it is not the case sensitive html always we have to start with html and uh, when we start from html the angle bracket it should be there angle bracket so after html always prefer to use tab key from the keyboard so that it becomes easier now this is actually the concept of html this is a programming concept afterwards you can write here head again i'll explain you title actually this is the head section whatever i'll write under title will display on the top of your web page so what i am writing here i am writing here learning my first web page i am closing it it's not a case sensitive okay i am just writing in capital so that it becomes easier for you to understand to see it once i have started this like i started this i have to close it also i'll explain it slowly and slowly then here i'll close it with head section these are all commands it is not a point and click environment here you have to uh, this is point and click environment when i'm clicking it gives the response to me but here we have to type and give all the command okay after this uh body section body section uh simply okay after giving writing body i'll write some text here i write that this is my first program in html okay i'll close it here yeah this is the forward slash this is the forward slash in your keyboard it is body and then closing html now this is my first program and i want that you should also do those who have mobile they can do on mobile those who have computer or laptop they can do it on computer or laptop afterwards you have to click on file save as in save as now i have to go to desktop where i have already made one folder students folder and in that ninth now here this is very important while saving the file suppose my i'll write here 
one dot full stop that means you have to put dot html this is very important you have to give this name this html is very important okay then save it okay is it clear save save as and one dot html is it clear so i have already saved it once you have done i'll just pause it and then i check where it is so i'll open my student folder In student folder ninth so here is my html file you could see it here actually here you are seeing dot html in your case it not it it will not be shown because i have done the settings and i have on the settings file name extension so if i close this i am not able to see but i used to prefer for my, uh, so that it becomes easier for me sometimes i have to rename the extensions also so okay anyway i can just on this then by default it will not open in the web browser which i want opera it will open but i don't want opera i'll prefer i'll prefer with internet explorer okay so i'll click on internet explorer because it's easier now you see my first program is in front of you so dear students if you have done as i have told you will get the same result i'll again uh, tell you how to do it now this is my program saved in student folder if you right click it when you want to see the source means what the coding open with you have to just see now here i am not able to find my notepad uh, i have to just uh, go with choose another app and here i have to find i'll just wait i'll zoom out uh, you will see i am not able to see notepad here just see where the notepad is yes this is the notepad click on okay so my program opens for me okay this is my program it opens for me head title learning html so i have written here uh this is my first program in html if i'll add something here suppose i love my school and i click on file and save i can minimize it also or i can close it also you know the way how to do it and then right click open with you know very well open with internet explorer i can make it as default also see here can you see this is my first program you can i am increasing the size by pressing control plus control plus key that is on the right side the plus is there na ab uh, above enter so i am just doing that i am zooming this so this is my first program in html i love my pro i love my school so okay uh, i hope it is clear to you now coming to the part describing tag once you have done this program i'm just i'll just close it i'll just open that coding once again now this is always very important that a program starts from html and ends with html so this is a forward slash then heading now you know we have always two parts in our html program head section or this is called the head section this is called the head section this is called head section and the bottom part 
is called body section. So, always two parts are there head section and body section. So, I will so this is body section ok head section and body section this is body section means whatever I am writing here under head that comes on the top of the web page. I'll show you. Uh, I'll open this and again I'll open this with the help of Internet Explorer. You could see here the name learning my first web page, learning my first web page. So whatever I am writing here learning my first web page under title that comes on the top that comes on the top here title i hope it is clear then further whatever i am writing here in the body section that comes on the screen so i hope you have understood the body section and head section the structure is very much clear to you okay so just follow the rules what i have told you try to make this program try to make this program at your home or the, the now the next tutorial which i'll make that i'll make for the students who are having uh, mobiles and not having pc so i'll and do the screen recording and do the same program or maybe some other program in the mobile so that you should know how to do that okay just wait for my next tutorial